I'm Caelan Petty. I'm working at the Village Butchery and I'm doing an apprenticeship. Um, hunting's a really big part of my life. Um, I've been brought up hunting. We're always taught to hunt for the pot. So doing this apprenticeship will be awesome because then it'll give me a chance to help process my whānau and friends meet in the future. Typical day in the butchery, uh, I'm usually in the front, front, you know, working with my customers, helping in the shop, and sometimes I'm out the back prepping and helping the boys cut up meat, break down stuff. Great skills to have is being able to socialise with other people, um, engage with your customers, also cutting skills, um, just basic common sense really in a butchery. I'm actually quite grateful that I work with wonderful men, like we all totoko respect each other. So I want to thank my dad, he's like my number one supporter. He's always encouraging and helping me with my apprenticeship. He's always trying to make it easier for me to cope in a male dominated um, industry. And secondly, the women in my whānau are hard workers and they have influenced me that hard work and dedicated perseverance is one step to success. So the benefits of doing an apprenticeship is that you earn while you learn. So no student loans, no tuition fees and hopefully no debit. Um, taking a gap year from high school was probably one of the best decisions for me because working here I actually got to get a really good feel and insight on how the butchery works. And after COVID last year, I thought, why not give it a crack and do an apprenticeship? So that's where I am now. So our apprenticeship goes for three and a half years, but um, the faster you go through your modules in the books, the faster you can finish your apprenticeship. In the future, I'm hoping to own my own butcher shop or open up a home kill service on the East Coast. You can be a female in a male dominated trade, you know? Great, great having her in the shop. Um... I've worked here for 17 years and we've had a lot of apprentices and you know, Kaylin's the first female apprentice and the first female apprentice in this shop in over 30 years. So it bring, brings a lot of joy to the shop and great value and customers love having a female um, serve them in a male dominated trade.